Hi, this is Brad Yeager with your weekly grain market update for the week ending Friday, March 13th. On the week, corn futures were down 9 to 10 cents, soybean futures were down 41 to 42 cents, and wheat was down 10 cents. Markets have been under extreme pressure this week due to the coronavirus and its possible global economic concerns. Crude oil has been down significantly as well, as Russia and Saudi Arabia have been engaged in a price-cutting war. One could argue that commodities have not been affected nearly as bad as other markets, but with the lack of other fundamental news, equity markets have pulled grains along lower. The biggest concern as of late for commodities is the lack of demand for U.S. ag products. The drop in crude oil and gasoline prices has put it at added stress on the ethanol industry, which is already operating in a low to no margin environment and reducing corn run rates. South American crop prospects continue to grow as they continue to export large amounts of soybeans to China. The U.S. is still waiting and wondering if China will make significant purchases to hold up their end of the trade deal. And with everything currently going on, we will likely not have that answer for a few months at very best. On Tuesday, the USDA came out with their March supply and demand estimates. The report had very few and minor changes from previous reports and basically was a non-factor in terms of moving the markets. We will have to look ahead to their quarterly stocks and prospective plantings report at the end of the month for possible changes. If you have any questions about what's going on or concerns, please give your local merchandiser a call. Thank you for listening to this week's Market Recap. Be safe and have a good weekend.